Hi, I'm Shotgun Fred of TheBarbecueGuru.com and in our previous segment we started a demonstration on using the VersaGrate with a wok. This is my trusty old wok. Of course, it's been a veteran of many cooks. You can see I've burned one of the handles completely off. But with these nice gloves that we uh, have on the site, you can uh, easily manipulate this this wok. Now I've taken the sausage that I put in there with a little oil and I've broken it up and I've browned it. So I've got it browned sufficiently so that I can set it aside and then I'll still have some of these oils in which to uh, start browning my rice. So I'm going to just dump this off into this bowl and I'll be putting that back on later. Now you can see that our fire is uh, very nice. we got a lot of uh, a good hot charcoal burning there so I'm going to put that back on and then I'm going to put these are three different kinds of pre-cooked rice uh, this is one that I pre-cooked it's caramelized and brown and it's got all kinds of goodies in it that's for flavor and color and then this is another pre-cooked rice that I did uh, this lets you uh, working ahead that way uh, lets you make your jambalaya a lot faster now, if in fact uh, I was going to start from scratch, I would start by putting water in the uh, wok, and then I would put my rice in, and then I'd cover it with this lid and let it steam. Now, what I'm going to do in this case though, is I'm going to use the oil, and I'm going to allow the oil to brown my rice. See, I could use just a little bit more oil, so I'll just dump a little bit more oil in there. And one thing about this type of cooking, it's kind of uh, flying by the seat of your pants. You do a little of this and a little of that and watch the process, vary the process. See, I've got some nice colors in there now, so that later when I put my vegetables in, uh, cabbage and so forth, uh, I'll be able to get some nice color variations and I'll be able to steam it all together. Now what I've found is as you're doing this type of browning of the rice, now you see how nicely the VersaGrate keeps that wok on center. I can really uh, walk it around and not have to worry about it uh, flying out of there. And uh, of course I can turn the wok, use one hand to operate the wok, the other hand to operate the, the stir. And I can keep scratching off all that, all those little flavor particles that want to stick to the wok. This is a good thing. And I can take this to any extent that I want. From time to time, I'll just add a little broth. This is chicken broth. And uh, just keep stirring it. I don't want to moisturize it all at once because I want to keep adding flavors so that the rice will absorb all those flavors. And I can continue to work the rice in the wok until I'm very satisfied uh, with its texture. In the next section, we'll cover it up, let it steam a while, add the sausage back, and the rice will be ready. I can also add a few vegetables and close the lid and let them steam right in with the uh, jambalaya rice.